What is the episode? Is it five? Uh, four or five. I, I'm going to say five. That's probably a good guess. All right. Uh, welcome back to Cookies and Milk. Uh, so when are you, you're running for president. Absolutely. Yeah, dude, what are you going to tell me, you sly I, dog, you I, sneaky... I've tossed sneaky? my hat in the ring, and the hat kind of floated away in the water. Uh, uh, not, uh, third party? No, fourth party is still probably all pushing All party! It. Woo! Zero oh, party. I'm, I am a zero, and uh, I'm at party. <laughs> talk to me about your campaign. You gotta pour the milk. Talk to me about your campaign. Talk to me about your promises. Milk for everyone. Good, I like it. A full cup of milk for everyone. Are you going to make it legal to sit on the Lincoln Memorial's lap again? Uh, I like think the everyone, founding fathers I think, wanted? I think everyone can sit on Daddy Lincoln's lap. Sorry. These liberals. They don't what? need to do it anymore. They, they want to make it illegal. They say, the don't liberals, do that. I'd imagine the liberals would want to sit on <laughs> Daddy Lincoln's lap. Oh, what is that? A judge? Like a jab? <laughs> How dare you? What are you doing? For the milk. I, <laughs> you stuck your finger in my face. What is... Pour the milk. All right. Anyway, I'm I'm your host, William. I'm your host, Ben. And this is Cookies and Milk, a uh, podcast where we talk about things and eat cookies and milk. That's too much milk. I'm sorry. Where's Raboob? Hey, Raboob. Maybe get your... I, I'm not going to say it anymore. I can't say <laughs> Daddy Lincoln anymore. <laughs> Just said it. Oh, no. I was trying to get some milk. I... So... Have you seen Alolan Doug Trio? Yeah, nice hair, dude. I love it. Like, it's absolutely hilarious. It's literally out of nowhere that he's just... It's... Holy shit. It's my... It's honestly the best. Like, who would have predicted uh, such an amazing change? That's the only... I'm I'm not accepting any of the other leaks until I see them in-game. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> no! Ben's cookie just broke off in the milk. Like he got an he got an edge of it. Oh god. my god! You're not accepting any of the other leaks and stop flicking milk everywhere, huh? I'm not accepting any of the other leaks until I see them in game. And with a full head of hair. Yeah, that's the only way I accept Pokemon from now on. <laughs> so. I have played the Pokemon Sun and Moon demo. Have you? No. Okay. I haven't turned on my 3DS in months. Yeah, I know. There's, like, games I want you to beat, but you're not making any progress in. I, buddy, come on. Like, I know you don't like Pokemon Red, but you gotta grind all your Pokemon up to level 30 before you fight Lieutenant Surge, because that's what I did. Even I though don't I... have to. Yeah, but why would you do that to yourself? <laughs> <laughs> the third, the second cookie, <laughs> Ben had in, also broke off on the table. Oh, the sorry. Rest of the... Oh, right, we have to say what cookie we're eating. Okay, we're eating Ben's Cookies brand, chocolate ben, chip cookies. Benton's, you said Ben's. Benton's. Bentus? Not, no, not another Kingdom Hearts podcast. Benton's. Benton's Cookies brand, chocolate chip cookies, that are, and I quote, Full of real chocolate chips. Let's go ahead and hit up the ingredients. Okay. What? This is, this can't be a good podcast. We're listing ingredients. Semi sweet chocolate chips. Oh god. Enriched it. <laughs> enriched <laughs> flour. And parentheses, parentheses wheat flour. See, I didn't. I skipped this because you said it wouldn't be a good podcast. Niacin reduced iron. I'm putting the cookies away. Go ahead. I'm just going to put the cookies away. Uh, hey, Raboob. No. You know, more giving milk to the cats. Did you watch the episode on YouTube? What? The last episode of the podcast on YouTube? Um, I have not. I've only, I've listened to it on the made recording on the phone. Because if I look it up on my, on YouTube, on my phone, it will be a different Viewer giving one view, and that's a false view. That's a fine. I don't want to leave I don't people wanna... on like that. Leave yeah, myself that's, that's on a like lying that. view. How many views have we gotten on the first episode? I think we're like 10. Sick. That was terrible. Oh, <laughs> okay. That's no more high five. No more high fives. 
That was fake. He, had, <laughs> he clapped his hand. He just clapped his hand next to the phone. It's a kind of vibe, bro. All right, the Sunny Moon there. demo. No, that's Ben. That's just Ben. Chill with the cookies. <laughs> like we only have four cookies. You've botched two of them, and we're only. We're twenty minutes in. Not twenty minutes in. We're only five minutes in. So back to the Sun and Moon demo. I played it. I did not find the Alolan Dug Trio. I don't know where to. I don't know where to look. But I will say, the trial in Ten Carat Hill is, eh, like it definitely is there to show off the abilities, like the new features of the game. Yeah. What are you doing with your phone? Are you taking a picture? Who are you taking a picture of? Oh, it's rubble on a cooler. Okay. Uh, you need to not. You can keep talking. You dude. keep prioritizing rubble over me telling stories. I'm not prioritizing anybody. You have your camera I can phone. Listen absolutely. And take a picture. Take at the, the same picture. Time. Take the picture. He's not facing this way. Rubble. Rubble. There he is. Nope. He's getting. He left. Oh, he's coming. No. What do you? Dude. Oh, bam. Oh, that's a bad picture. Okay. You gotta deliver on this. You gotta post it in the description, huh? <laughs> no, there he goes. He left. He doesn't want to take a picture. He wasn't doesn't want to get his picture taken. All right. Speaking of pictures, actually, this oh uh, the in Pokemon the Poke Finder, uh, it's <laughs> definitely a thing. I'm sure there'll be more fun locales for it. But in the demo, it's just take a picture of the new Dragon Pokemon. Grandpa? What? Grandpa? Not, dra not, not Drampa. I wish I could take pictures of Drampa. No. It's, Kamoo? It's the Kamoo. And then the second evolution of Kamoo. The Kamoo is the final evolution. Oh, well, you don't take a picture of Kamoo. You take a picture of the first. And then. Right, the one I don't know. Right. I don't know what evolves into Kamoo. We're being sued by <laughs> a Pokemon company. Oh, yeah, they got us. Uh, they don't want me talking about the. Uh, the, the leak? The demo leak? The demo leak. I'm the only one that's ever played the demo, so... Yeah, you stole a copy of Sun <laughs> I, and Moon, actually. I only got the demo. Like, I broke into Game Freak's HQ in good old Japan. Had your hacker gear on? Uh, my hacker gear, my my glasses were uh, all blazoned out. You tossed the USB drive into the first computer you I could find. I flicked it in, uh, and I just so happened to pull the demo, and I released it without Nintendo even being the wiser. And I only I was the only one that got to play it before they took it down. <laughs> they took it down immediately. <laughs> I released it with them being none the wiser. They're really good. Ooh, they got me immediately. Uh, there. I was able to play it as the FBI was busting down my door. And it's it's not the best way to show off. I mean, putting uh, overpowered Pokemon in your hand and then giving you another overpowered Pokemon later in the demo. Uh, that in the first Pokemon you get is like ten levels higher than the starting Pokemon battle, and then you're giving the Pikachu that it just has the super move that kills the final flying type boss. Not excited for Z moves. Z moves, mm, Z moves. I don't understand. I mean, I don't understand the Z moves that deal a bunch of damage, because a Z move of Hydro Pump. What's the point? Yeah. With Hydro Pump, you're gonna just do a bunch of water damage and kill that Pokemon. When you look at competitive play in, I guess it can be used for taking out a tank, but in competitive play, I don't see a lot of uh, moves that don't one-shot. Yeah. Like, what's the point of maxing out a Thunderbolt if the Thunderbolt can already do what it's going to do? Yeah, it seems like... Is it used to fight if you're... If, say, you're, you have that Pikachu, say you want to use the Z-Move on a Graveler. Not a Graveler, it has ground. <laughs> on an... <sighs> a Grass Pokemon. Is Grass strong to Electric? I think so. It might just be... Is it neutral? It's probably just neutral to Electric. <laughs> Back on Pokemon. Anyways, what's Grass... What's Electric <laughs> good against? What resists Electric? I'm just trying to think of a solid rock type. Not, like... Put your phone away. Where is... Googling. Oh, whether, sorry. I thought 
I can't trust you anymore. You're looking up pictures of cats. Hey, have you seen her boob? <laughs> <laughs> the new Persian. I'm not, I'm not. I don't believe it until I it's, see it in the game. It looks like such a letdown, though. Yeah. Like what the fuck? Yep. It's like they swapped. It's like the meowth, meowth's uh bubbly looking cartoonish look, got swapped with Persian sleek uh cool look. The Alolan forms that's. Persian looks more like a meowth. Yeah. And meowth looks more like a Persian, and it's so weird. That such a like sneaky sassy Pokemon looks like it got stung by a bee. <laughs> like why? Why did it? Why is it that? I have no idea. It's like I I, I don't believe it until I see it in the game. I don't believe it. All right. Uh, I hope I I hope it's not true. It's one half as effective against dragon, against electric, and against grass. What? Yep. Alright, look yep. up a solid rock type, though. Because this is eating away at me. Uh, they... Nose pass? Nose pass? Yeah, nose pass is a solid rock. Say you're fighting a nose pass. I'm fighting a nose pass. Okay. And you're out of Pokemon. You're out of usable Pokemon. Uh, except for your Pikachu. Uh, but this is like Endgame. You're fighting a Probo Pass, actually. Why do you still have a Pikachu, bud? Uh, you can give it a light ball, and it's actually Fuck. almost a viable team member. Shut up! <laughs> God! I mean, great. I can understand if Pikachu... Don't you have to make it hold a thing to make to activate the Z-move, though? You gotta give Pikachu the, uh... The Lightning Z or something. lightning um or whatever. Weird. It's like another Mega Evolution. Like a worse Mega hold Evolution. Hold on a minute. Oh, also in an interview, there's only Mega Evolutions in the post game. Yeah, I read about that. That's... I mean, all right. Seems like you just don't want to make Mega Evolutions, new Mega Evolutions, and I can understand that because the Alolan forms. Hmm. I can't understand that. Replacing them with Z moves is just worse. You only use them once. Yeah. It's not like you can switch to another one with a Z move. Man, that's. I like I, I saw Z moves like the first time, and it was like. You can do a crazy Pikachu Z move or an Eevee Z move, and I was like, "This is like literally just welcome to Pokemon." You want to make Eevee a viable Pokemon to use? Use its Z move. Throw that away for the entire rest of the match. Yeah, and then the Eevee will be decent. Uh, it is crazy to imagine though that you can. I can't wait for the next game because the when they're done with Z moves and they're like, you can Mega Evolve and you can Z move and you can do some other nonsense. Yeah. Uh, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, not including new Pokemon, that are exclusively rock type. Nine? Nine. Can wow. You, can you guess? You want to guess them? So there's Nose Pass, Probo Pass. Shh, yep, that's two. Oh, Probo Pass is not on this list. I think Probo Pass might get a... You think he's a Steel type? If I had to guess. Hmm. Uh, Probo Pass is in fact Rock Steel, good guess. Hey! Well, then I get I win. I don't need to guess the rest of the rock Pokemon. What are you talking about? <laughs> there's wait, is it the, there's also the the new dog, right? I'm not counting the new dogs. Okay. So nine not including the new dogs. So is Onyx one of them? Onyx is rock ground. Of course. Everything is rock ground. Everything is rock. There ground. wasn't a solid rock type until Gen two. Shuckle? No, Shuckle's normal, dude. Don't what? fuckle with Shuckle. Pseudo Udo is the first is solid the rock first type. Solid rock type. Bonsai's the other one. Yep. Bonsai oh my is god. A solid rock type. So there's Bonsai. Pseudo Udo. Udo. Nose pass. Nose pass. Three. You got six more. Uh, two of these. I don't think you're gonna get. Excuse you. <laughs> I'm you a guess, Pokemon master. You get wrong like five times already. <laughs> I got Rock Steel on Probo Pass. Yeah, you got that out of nowhere. All right, uh, I'll give you a hint. Uh, the next one is in Gen Three. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. What? There were Rock types in Gen Three. Well, Nose Pass is one of them. Oh right, of course. Uh, but there's another. Pretty significant rock type in Gen 3. 
Uh, seems like it's a big thing. Oop. Podcast. Podcast. Pokemon podcast. William doesn't know rock names <laughs> and Gen 3. Who the fuck? What is that? Is that a play doll? It's not a ball toy. Oh, they are psychics. Should I pinch his ground? There's uh, Nummel and Canterrupter fire ground. Groudon's ground. Relicanth? No, he's water rock. Wait, what? Relicanth is water rock. Oh, I thought you were nodding to the fact that... Oh, no, you said water rock, and I was nodding to water rock. Okay, yeah. um... Who could it be? Okay, uh... Real quick, list every single Pokemon in Gen 3. I can. <laughs> um... Rock types in Gen 3, huh? Rock types in Gen 3. Exclusively rock types. It can't be Soul Rock and Lunatone. Nope. They're rock psychic. Psychic, yep. Who... Oh, it's gonna, gonna piss you off so much. It's gonna piss me off so much. I gotta think of this. I gotta go through. <laughs> Let me get my old copy of Sapphire, play through it a bit, see who it is. I'll get back to you guys in like three hours. Who? Who the fuck? Who the fuck? It's gonna annoy you so much. <sighs> is it. I'm trying to go through all the caves in the game. Mmm. How can I say Gen 3 is my favorite if I don't know the solid rock? Oh man, dude, it's in a it's in a cave too. No, it's in a cave. Reggie Rock. Yep. What the god damn it? <laughs> god damn it! His name is Reggie Rock. Oh He's my in, god. Like, the most significant caves in the game. Oh my god, Reggie Rock. Of course. It's not even that fun making you guess. All right, uh, there's one in Gen 4. There's two in Gen 4. Uh, Reggie Rock. Uh, yep. All right. There's another one. Oh, what's the other one? Reggie. Up uh, the CEO of Nintendo. Yes. Of America. Yeah. Rock. Yep. Who are they? It's Granados and Ramparos. Really? Yeah, they're exclusively rock. Huh. Right. All right. Uh, and then there are three in Gen Five. Gen Five. Is it the Boldor? Rock and Rolla, Boldor, and Gigalite. Huh. I thought they would have been rock and ground, but nope. I guess it makes sense because they're just purely rocks. They needed uh, more. How long are we going on this? 17 minutes. It's, it's six Me It was six just, minutes of silence as you was a rock type. God damn it. The entire podcast is me trying to remember who Reggie Rock is. <laughs> Alright, dude, you want to guess all the mono ground types? Um. Sandsru, Sandslash. Yep. Uh, Trap Hinge. Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of them in Gen 1. A lot of no, them. no! It yeah, happened no. again. Was that the third one or the fourth one that happened to? It's the third one that happened right. to. I had one good one. So, who's a ground type in Gen 1? You've gotten one, two, uh, three out of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. That many ground types in Gen 1? Oh, no, there are six in Gen 1. Oh, um... There's Sandslash, Sandslash, Sandslash. Maybe that's a Pokemon in Gen 1. There's a surprising amount of ground types. And no solid rock types. Diglett in Doug Trio. Yep. So that's four out of the six. Mm -hmm. Who's... Wow, you got your coaster filled with milk, huh? I had to shove my hand 100% of the way in my cup. I did miss a bit when I was pouring your cup, but still... <laughs> Um, oh, you blamed it on me. <laughs> you broke my cookies earlier. <laughs> Frame me for this mess. I could see you mistaking them for, like, normal types. Huh. That probably just makes things more confusing. Yeah, like, who would I think? Who would I think would be a normal type? Who is actually just ground? They, it isn't... Need a queen, need a king, or ground poison. Yep. Ground. Who else could it be? You up? No. I'm gonna go through the Pokemon. Uh, Electrode, no. 
Pokemon! It's still like trying. <laughs> That's the Pokemon. I'm gonna chug my milk, think about it. Uh, uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna sing the whole Pokemon. P. Electro, Diglett, Nidoran, Mankey, Venusaur, Rattata, Fero, Pinky, uh, King, Jolteon, Dragon, Pokemon. Or Dead Space. <laughs> while I was chugging the milk, <laughs> drop the ball yet again. I made a claim I couldn't fulfill. Yeah, I why apologize. Would you, why would you even try to do that? Is it? It's not right one. No. I think they're rock and They're rock ground. Of course they are. Yep. Six ground types. Six ground types in Gen One. What was Gen One doing? We need to talk about the Gen One debacle. It's terrible. Okay. I've been playing through. Can't talk about this right now. You need to talk about this on another podcast. I should but talk. all I say, you just gotta get you just gotta get into the flow of things. I'm really enjoying it. Checking the time. We are twenty one minutes in, we gotta make this fast. Just list them two. List them both. You give up? Um I give fifteen seconds. Uh you wanna name the other exclusively ground types in the meantime? There are two in Gen 2. Uh, there's two in Gen 3. Fucking for Pinch and... <laughs> you, you already... You it's already just for Pinch, my baby boy! Who is in Gen 1? <laughs> there's, uh, three in Gen 5. <laughs> Buddy! That's enough! Uh, it's... Crocorock... No. Nope. Sandile? No. Oh, they're all... Crown Dark. Uh, read them! Read the two... <laughs> In Gen 1. Uh, in Gen 5, it's Hippopotas, Hippowdon, and Drillbird. Gen In Gen four. 3. It's Gen 4. Were they Gen 4? Yeah. Who cares? Drillbird, wait. Drillbird Drill was five. Gen 5. Hippopotas was sure. Gen 4. Uh, we gotta hurry this up, Drupinch right? and Groudon are the... Of grand course, types. of course. <laughs> uh, Fampy and Dawnfan are the ground types of Gen 2. Right. And Cubone and Marowak, and oh! we'll end it on that one. Those two! I love those two. You can see them being normal types. I forgot about them. Yeah, yeah you that's did. always how the info works in my head. I think about it, I can't, I can't remember it. All right, that's the end of the Pokemon podcast. Cookies and milk. Tune in next time when we're talking about Kingdom Hearts. Not Kingdom Hearts. Maybe Kingdom Hearts depends on how deep in the subject we get. But we will see you next time.